So I was talking to my people over at Twitter about this, but I'm no longer, I don't want you guys calling me king. That's just, that's just weird. I am no real king. I'm Kenny, all right? Kenny. The playoffs start in literally like two hours. I don't, I don't have a watch on, but I'm pointing at my wrist. We're continuing this trend where we talk about things playoffs because this is like the best time of the year for an NBA fan. Today we're taking a quiz to see how many of the top ring getters of all time we know. Does that make sense? Maybe not. You know what I mean. Okay, there are 37 questions. No waste, no time. Russell. Bill Russell. I mean, we all know Bill Russell. 11 rings. He got more rings than fingers. He's wearing one on his toe right now. Get ready to watch the playoffs. Dude is still alive, which is great. Uh, but now we just got to think of his teammates. There were two Joneses on the squad. Casey Jones and Sam Jones. Um, have LeCheck play with him. So did, uh, I don't know how to even pronounce this guy's name. Tom. And then there was one more guy that I was sure of. I don't think Frank Ramsey played with them. I think he was a little bit before. But it only makes sense that he played with them. I don't really know. I just found out who Frank Ramsey was a couple days ago because of y'all. Somebody sent me a, a quiz of like forgotten NBA players. Never heard of the name before. Frank Man Ramsey never heard of the name before until I took that quiz. I'm not, if it's anything before, to be honest with you, 2003, I've never seen it. Every, pretty much everybody on this list, I do not, like I didn't see with my own eyes. Only thing I have is numbers and stories. But let's keep going, man. Let's start with, um, with my team, Pippen, Jordan, Rodman. Kerr, Sally, uh, Grant, Horace Grant, Will Purdue, yes, um, but I think that's all the Bulls on this list, there's another Bull, can that be Ron Harper, yeah, you, I, come on, I know about these things, you know how many documentaries my parents made me sit through, I mean, they didn't really make me, but I, I wanted to, are those all the Bulls players, cool, all the Bulls players, all right, Lakers, uh, Kobe Bryant, Shaquille O'Neal, Robert Ory, he counts. He won team uh, championships with a couple different teams. Lakers being one of them. Big Shot Bob, baby. Derek Fisher. Uh, George Mikan. Mikan. Uh, Magic Johnson. Like, I'm just getting all the easy ones out of the way. Michael Cooper played alongside Irvin Magic Johnson. Uh, okay. I got 21 in like a minute and a half. I'm, that's, that's a, I'm impressed with myself right now. Bucks, Lakers. Bucks Lakers. Uh, oh, <laughs> Kareem Abdul Jabbar. Not, not. I will not forget his name. Abdul Jabbar, number one in points all time regular season. I think number two or three in playoffs. Six rings. Six rings. He got one with the Bucks. Then he went out. He went out to LA and got five. Uh. Okay. There's another guy on the Celtics that I don't know. Again, that that team was. <laughs> My parents weren't even thought of back then, so there's no way. There's no way. Other than me reading about it, there's no way for me to know that stuff. Spurs. Oh, okay, Spurs. Tim Duncan. Um, David Robinson, did he win four plus? No, he did not. Uh, but you know who did? Tony Parker. Ginobili. Yes, spelled it right first try. That's that's good stuff there. Okay, is that all the Spurs players on this? On this? Yes, it is. Oh, Celtics Bulls. Oh, there's Robert Parrish. He didn't win a championship here, but he retired here. At least I don't think he won one here. I think the teams are legitimately just what teams that they play for. Not what teams they win a championship with, just what teams that they play for. And he did retire here. Uh, we got more Lakers players. Those got to be players that played alongside um, Magic Johnson or something. Because I, I really don't know him. But Lakers Hawks. I'm at 26, and I cannot think of anybody else. That Celtics 8. I feel like I should know every Celtics player on that. Not everyone, but, like, the ones that mattered. Can we just... Oh, we did Johnson. What is some more... I know it's not going to be a Smith on his list. But, you know, we can just type in random last names. And sometimes it'll help, but this time it won't. John Havlicek. Um, the Joneses. Sanders. Tom Sanders. Okay. That's 27 out of 37. That sounds bad. Like, in my head, that sounds bad. But I can't think of any any other player that has more than four rings. I think this is this is how good as good as my list gets. Um, so you know what? We're done. We're done. With three minutes to spare, give up. Bob Cousy. Ah, okay. Uh, he's one of the forgotten players for me, at least. I've never heard of this guy. He must have been like. L lost cutoff. Jim lost cutoff. I let. Let's do a quick Google search. 
All right, so here we click on his Wikipedia page. May he rest in peace. He just passed away a couple years ago. Yeah, he didn't really... <laughs> How am I supposed to remember a dude from the 50s and 60s that averaged six points per game? I'm not considering that an L. I don't, if you got that right, I don't even know. You got to be a diehard Celtics fan for that. Um, I guess his nickname is retired. His number is retired? Okay, then maybe you should know who he is. If, if his number is retired, it is. Wow. It retired the year he got done playing. Okay, let's just keep looking at who he missed. I'm just coming to the realization, oh, well, not just now, but the Celtics, they retire everybody's number. If we look at every number on this list, one, two, three, six, 10, 14, 15, yeah, every, oh, they didn't even retire dude's number. I just peeped that. They just retired his name. All right, they retired his name. I think that's like, a, that gotta be like an honorary type thing, right? Because these other dudes, um, like Bob Cousy, John Havlicek, Dave Cohens, these are like all time greats. Six points per game, you shouldn't get your numbers in the Raptors, but I think it's just that he was there for so long, he got them rings, helped them get rings, retire him. And yeah, uh, Johnny Mose, may he, did he die? I think he passed away. Yeah, he passed away before I was even born. But some of these guys, Kurt Rambis is one that I probably could have got. But everybody else, I've never heard of Pep Saul, Jim Pollard, never. Vern, I think it's a name I should know. Let me Google that because that sounds familiar. That sounds very familiar. Google it. He averaged 14 and about 10. Yeah, okay. Uh, maybe six-time All-Star. It's cool. I'll, I'll take those L's. Thank y'all for watching, man. Uh, I got a 70, what, 2? 70... 2%, the average score is a 35, so I got double of what the average man go get. There's no way nobody watching this video got a 100% without Google searching, without taking it twice, or whatever. Without cheating, there's no way. Who is Pep Saw? How do you know that? I just looked him up. He averaged like four points per game in his career. You're not going to remember him. You're not going to remember him. But thank y'all so much for watching. It has been Kenny. Yes, I'm no longer doing the king in the fourth quarter thing. I'm. It's Kenny or I don't know. I don't know. I'm still trying to figure it out. But I appreciate it if y'all just call me Kenny. It makes things so much easier. But thank y'all so much for watching. I'm out.